Jesus is King. This is Timothy Flanders, editor of 1 Peter 5. The vice of effeminacy, says St. Thomas, is the reluctance to suffer due to an attachment to pleasure. The reluctance to suffer due to an attachment to pleasure. This is a spiritual vice. It is distinct from the perfection of feminine nature, which is femininity. It's a completely different thing. Effeminacy is a spiritual vice. Now, we see this most prominently when men are effeminate, because men must, as St. Paul says, do manfully. Do manfully. Now, in particular, the most prominent ways in which we are attached to pleasure in our world are pornography, food, pleasures, the social media slave master who is currently addicting you to dopamine, serotonin, likes, whatever psychological manipulation they're doing, technology. But in particular, the concupiscible appetite in your being that God created for what is good, namely food and the conjugal act, has been corrupted into the vices of gluttony and lust. And the way that the fathers has told us and taught us and passed on to us to overcome this vice is bodily fasting. You must embrace bodily fasting to attack gluttony and lust. Gluttony and lust are the first vices to overcome. If you have not overcome these with bodily fasting, your spiritual life is continually hitting a brick wall. If you want to advance in the spiritual life, you must embrace bodily fasting. See the link for more.